Good morning, my fellow Nords. Today we are at um, Blackthorn. This is Skyrim Mod Coffee Reviews. I am Gajara. He is half asleep, and I am Ms. Milo7. There's another one. We gotta kill doggies. Okay, now. That, where were we? Um, yes. <laughs> we are Gajara and Ms. Milo7, and today we are going to be reviewing Blackthorn. It is a mod done by LD50365. He is also the one that did yesterday's review, um, mod review, The Scarlet. So it's going to be very much the same thing in terms of how to do this. First, the, let's take a look at what you come get with what, the mod. This one's a whole buildable town. Yes. You get this glorious <laughs> town. Look at this. I mean, it's just... Okay, let's get down to really building this. Okay. So what you want to do is you want to start off here in the trader. Now you want to show them where you are first too. I should, shouldn't I? Yes, you really should. Let's show you where this is at. <laughs> like I said, he's sleepy. I am. <laughs> okay, we are between Iverstead and... Um, Rifted. Rifted. <laughs> um, let's see, what else? Darkwater Pass. There's the Greenwall. Fort Greenwall. Um, there is an Orcish stronghold and somewhere in this area. As well. Dark Light Tower is down here. But it's basically equidistant almost between Iverstead and Rifton. So if you haven't found either one, either, found it, you just have to walk. It's on a path. Now, there should be a little warning coming with this particular mod. I know that it's not just us. There's been mm -hmm. lots of comments about it, but this mod does cause crash to desktop. It, they, it, the only time I crash is trying to go into the manor itself, Blackthorn Manor. I can go into every other building, but I do crash sometimes. Stupid dog. At some point, it was always. I yeah. would crash going in into Blackthorn, which really breaks my heart because I love this mod and I would put my kids and spouse here all the time, but I can't. Okay. So what you want to do is read this little blue book. I'm not going to go through the whole thing, Sorry, but... My cat's here. Pretty girl. Pretty girl. Come on up. Come on up. Read the little blue book and it'll get you started. Pretty girl. Pretty girl. There you go. Now, if you... Again, it's the same thing like with the cheat. Build yes. the house first, the Blackthorn Manor, and get your cheat if you want it. Otherwise, you can build it piecemeal. As you can see, all the different ones. Put, purchase the Blackthorn Manor and go. If you want to do the cheat. We're going to do the cheat. So. We, we always do. But it will max you out. Um, your weight. Your weight. It will put you several thousand over your carry weight. We do this because we cheat and we have like um, true Nightingale and my carry weight is max 10,000. So I can do this. Okay. So can he. Blackthorn Manor. A no. gorgeous home. Let's step inside because everything can be done. Need to be done first before we look at this. Usually you won't crash until and what do it before I say it, but you won't crash until it's after you build the house and all. So you just have to be careful, you know, and adjust. It says adjust load, load order and stuff, but you know, you can see the, the workbenches are out. So, come in here to this do the read me. wardrobe and do read this. It says these activators are to in disable and enable <coughs> all the various workbenches along with a cheat supply chest containing all the building supplies needed to complete Blackthorn. Remember, press each button twice when first using them, then only press, only one press is needed afterwards. Yeah, go by that because they mean it. You have to have two. Okay, we want this one, one. Yes. And you'll see two. it. Two. There you go. There it is. 
and see what your carry weight is. Yeah, you're at 10,049. His max is 10,315, so he's okay. Okay. But that's now, what you're going to walk. Miss Milo did ask that I do something yesterday that I did not do, so we're going to do it today. What'd I do? What'd today I do? is fetus at 213. Okay. See how long it takes, basically. How much in-game time it takes to do yeah, this. Yeah, you should have checked it from yesterday because this one takes longer. This is the whole town. But it's still, yeah, I wanted to know how long it takes. Now, do recall, when the black screen comes up, don't push any buttons. And... If I am don't. going to go ahead and stop here, get this all done so that you can see what happens. Now, remember, if you don't want something, don't build it. Okay, we are back, and this house has been done. Just and the house, though. Just the house. There's still the whole town I've got to do, so we're going to do that again. But real quick, let's take a look at the time. It is now Loretus. I believe that's Tuesday, possibly Wednesday. Really? So Friday, 2.13 to Wednesday, 8.47. Really? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. You know the calendar. So okay. I think Loretta's is actually Wednesday. So let us take a look, starting with the upstairs, and we'll work our way down. We have the master bedroom. Yes. Look at this. Pictures. Hmm. The book of the do. Dragonborn. Some Black Briar Reserve. Hey, you you got money? And of course you're... Need to open that one? Oops. Ooh, secrets. Yes, I like this one. This is your trophy room. I do need to learn to do that glass framing. Yes, you do. Because that's nice. Especially here. This I like the table with the glass on top of it. Put your things in it. That, that, that just I got to learn to do that. Except the Quit mannequin. Quit looking at me. <laughs> The mannequins keep moving. <laughs> of course, once you put uh, outfits on them, they'll stop. And uh, they each have their own chests. So. And their own little um, weapons and shields. It's weapons and shield, like, up top. No, it's just shield. Oh, just shield? Okay. Just shield. Well, that's even better. Your claws. Paragons. Paragons. Got to have your paragons. I do like these little, um, these small pots. They've shrunk down. With the little planters in them. I think they're, it's a nice little effect if you can shrink them down. Masks? Yes. Um, Agma and Venom Black Star. Yes, your. Um, All the stuff that's in basically. Yes, your Daedrix. That's in most of the, the houses. Yes. The named stuff. Don't look at the dog. She's not bothering you. And of course, Dagger Racks. Unique clothing, unique weapons. Tiny little bit of glitching here and now, but here and there, but nothing major. Is there anything in these chests? No, okay. Just keep looking. It's been a while since I've actually roamed around yeah, it. it. Oh, there's something in the cupboard. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. And this. Then don't forget the fireplaces and now you gotta turn them off. Yes. There's your another teleport spell. That will take you into this house. The teleport spell takes you not just to the town, it will take you into this house. Red. Of course you I have try, again I tried that and it, of course it crashed too. Yeah, off I'll, and on, yes. Your amulets of your divine amulets? And storage for journals and recipes and spell tomes and stuff like that. Come over here. Let's turn the fireplace on because it's cold in here. And check out the blade. Blade of Blackthorn. Isn't that cool? Ooh, 543. Now for the house, you have over 10,000 and something. What's your carry weight now? You're down to 6,638. You were started out at 10,049. Yes. So the house, you will lose a whole bunch of your... Thing. Now, oh, in the um, go in the followers room as well because you, there's a, a 
This is the children's room, I think. This is the oh, bathroom. bathroom. Okay. Yeah, this is the bathroom. You can get a change appearance mirror that would go here. I don't put those in. I can't stand them. <laughs> Activate the sink. Turn the sink off. Step in the shower. Yes. Now, of course, I have lightning bolt. Lightning arrows on. Arrows, so I'm getting shocked it. really good. <laughs> Got your tub. With steam rising, of course. Sit down. Wash your feet from a long journey. <laughs> and it goes on your head. What a good idea. Now go over there. Going over here. That's of course you got your bookcases. Yes. Your cupboards. Well the cupboard's empty and but there was bookcases next to it, so this is the followers because it, and it's got a fireplace in it as well. Now, one of my followers seems to have an affinity for porn. Now now. Fall more blood elixir. Somebody been talking to Bryn off. Got that fire started. Nice cat. More mm. pictures. That same pic picture. Same picture. Same picture. <clears throat> and the other one. There. That's the kids with no fireplace. Yeah, my followers get warm, but not my kids. My kids <laughs> are going to stay cold. Room for six kids, and this is family, family friendly. If you have the. Um, hearth fire multiple adoptions. Yes, and you can, and if you can still get manage, it doesn't glitch on you. Right? Yes. <clears throat> Don't you know to that doll? <sighs> Spend ten minutes every time you have to go out somewhere trying to get past that damn doll. So that's the upstairs. Okay. Okay, right or left? Right. Okay. That's the door to the outside patio, the back patio. So yeah, this goes to the yet. patio. I'm going to go around the way, other way with this. This, I have to presume, is another follower. your staff staff quarters? It's another follower. Or followers. You only have one staff, and that's the... um. The steward that says stupid yeah. dog. You do have your shrines. Yes, you do, all of them, and with a little chest at the bottom of it. And your... Um, 13 stone. standing stones sitting area okay one of my favorite rooms coming up your office but look at all the bookshelves isn't that cool I mean that's why I, I can't it breaks my heart that I can't get in here because I I want to fill up the bookshelves now you do get a chess set but no chess, chess board. I have a feeling the chess board is a mod that I don't have well, whatever. It's, it's a shame, but... but it's no, you know it's a chess set, so, I mean, it's yes. really cool. It's really cool. More... More books? Bookshelves. Bookshelves, yes. And, of course, your office. It has the full Arthurium shard, but you can't take it. Mm -hmm. But that's okay. For treasure maps. Oh, i got to take my coin purses. And like the Scarlet, once you build the rest of the town, they will be here. In You'll the get shelf. these little chests here. And they will be full. Yes. They do respawn, so you're constantly making money through here. And flute, pot, bedroom. Now, the this dining is, room. This is a dining room. Sweet roll. And the wine over here, you can take the wine as well, I believe. You have to go to it to go look at it, but yes. Okay. Cabinet, you do the goblets. Oh, look at that. Nice. I didn't even notice that. Yes. Did you notice the wines you can take? No. You want to go look in the corner where I told you to go look? Well, yeah. See? Wine. Wine. Okay. Argonian, <laughs> Alto, Firebend, Surly Brothers. I don't know if they respawn or anything, but I just know you can take them. And that uh, sweet girl will... Respawn. Will spawn, so... Quit I saying that about that you dog. Silly. Oven? Oven. Cooking supplies, auto access door. I'm not sure what that yeah, exactly means, like it, but it. you know what? That's okay. Start the fire. Got your kitchen with all your cooking supplies. So if you can take as well, plus stuff you can store. 
A lot of some static as well, so that's good. It's just I like the way they've done the the shelves underneath the cabinets. The cabinets, yeah. yes, those are cool. And of course, gotta wash the dishes. That's why I get married so that my wife can wash the dishes for me. <laughs> okay, so that was the dining room. We are Hi. now going downstairs to my favorite. This is your armory, and they did a job on this. Yes. This is along the lines of Silverstead. I mean, it's beautiful. It's got a whole bunch of stuff. They're all the looking at rack. me. <laughs> the chest in front of them. And weapons racks interspersed in between. In, in, the, in between. And this I love with the, with the um, display cases and then the weapons racks behind it. Yes. That's very cool too. See how many of them there are? Just to, like I said, with these mods, you can just go crazy and take yes. stuff from everybody. In. It's a shame this place crashes so often. It really is. It break. It does break my heart. Okay, and then you have your. And this is glitch. This is. It's always been glitchy. This has always been glitchy, and I think the biggest reason for it is because of the fan. Yeah, I don't know where the fan would be going, but in any case. I mean, it's a nice touch. It's a nice smoothing area. Plus, there's um, safes underneath the workbench over there. The fan is a nice touch. I just think that might be the big cause of all that glitchiness there. Mm -hmm. Of course, your weapons, staff, storage. And you, start, you store it separately, which I don't like, so I don't do. Yeah. <laughs> you know, if I want to get all this stuff, it's going to be displayed. And that's why I have so many houses, so I can do everything Excuse me. I want. You got your spider imbuing. Imbuing. Al imbuing. <laughs> Alchemy. <laughs> enchanting. Shut up, it's enchanting. And Steph Enchanter. <laughs> and of course, scrolls. Oh, there's a black soul gem. You need soul gems. Grab some. Well, the loose ones. Yeah, these are certain. You don't have any. Yeah. I just had that one, this one. Okay. Okay, so that is Blackthorn Manor. We're going to take a step outside so that we can look at what they did outside to this. Did you do anything outdoors to it? Um, to the back yes. patio? Go around back patio then. We're going to go. Okay. See the back patio. Plus... I like this as well. One of the reasons, the could because my kids do go out and play on this back patio. You know, I don't know that they go around the town like they do in solitude, but they do go out here and play. And there is a dock down here with a travel system. With a the travel system, yes, I love that as well. Here's your back patio. Sit in space. And see a practice dummies down there. More sitting, benches. Yes. Come here, have some drinks with your neighbors. Got a nice view of the river down here. Yes, and the river's not done completely because you, your boat's not there, so you haven't finished all this. You don't. No, I don't think. Doesn't matter. No, that comes with that manner. Yes, but you have do have the apiaries and you have a little planting area on the side yard as well. And your fences are there. You've done those as well when you were making the house. Yes. And if you wanted to, you'd have a horse. Did you get that I horse? I got the horse. Oh, crap. This is another issue. I don't like the horses because they keep following me. I don't ride horses because I can't. We have nothing. Rogue. And he's cool, but he keeps showing up wherever I am. If, I, if he f comes out to fight a dragon, if I try to put him back... He follows me, so I don't. I don't. So let's go ahead and step out here, and we're going to take a look at the house, which is now much, much and better now that it's nice lit up. Nice shed over there. I have a shed for the horse. Stable. Yeah, stable. Whatever. Okay. It's a cover. So that's the house. <laughs> now, what the next step in this, of course, is to build the town. So you come back to the trader here. And again, we're not going to put you through this. I'm not going to put you through the whole building, but I, um, the whole 
getting the town done, but we are going to you do have to at least purchase the. You have to purchase them, and then you have to go into each separate building or purchase it, furnish it, purchase it, finish it, whichever you want. But all these things you have to go through, and it does take a little bit of time. Yes, it does. But you can see it's purchased yes, the from, house, yeah, farm, purchased house, the building. Fence, everything. The book, if you read the book, it tells you that, you know, welcome. They had planned on Stupid getting dog. here, but they couldn't afford it. And so whoever comes along has a chance yes. to take care of it for them, to buy the town and to fix the town up. So it's in that book. If you're going to do this, do come with a lot of money because... It's expensive. A little bit. Good to see you. Okay, so everything is purchased. Now you can also buy your stuff from the... Um, the merchant the here. Merchant. Plus, his wife has a whole bunch of stuff. Most of the other places around here sell a lot of building materials as well. As you build, you can buy from them as well. But the, you can purchase it all here. But if you want to purchase yes. it... Okay. It does take some money. Yes, it does. So, the town is done, and you can see I'm starting to get a big glitchy here. Yes. Starting to hesitate. But I am going to once again stop, build everything, and we'll take a look around. Okay. We are back, and the town is done. We have... Um, pull, pull all our, map. we will pull out the map. We have hired all our guards. We have brought in a lot of citizens. We've got chickens. Chickens. <laughs> um, let us take a look at the local map. Yes. And you this got. is your town. Okay. And we have farmhouse, trader, the, guard of course, the fence up here on the left-hand side, that's the fence, the gate. Around. That's a gate, and that's a gate, and I believe and the there's a gate The where you started, where he's standing. Yes, the trader here. Got you an inn. Um, elixirs. Novels. It's, yeah, that bothers me. One of the things I thought was cute was, you have Nico's place. He is the groundskeeper. Yeah, he's my cat. Um, one of my cats. You've got your smithing and forging, followers, barracks, and of course, this is your manor here. Um, pelts and hides. Owen and Annette are just citizens. Yes, and behind there is your... You do have a guest house right here. And you have two followers in there already. Yes, you do. I haven't actually used them. Now, we did time it uh, in real time, and it took uh, about an hour. Yes. To do, to do the, all, put all this together. And that's just going from one to the other, just, you know, hammer and hammer and hammer and whatever. Yes. Just that was just going together. straight through with the cheat, so. Yeah, it can take you some time to get all this together. Um, when the, everything comes up, there are, uh, merchants in the stalls here. Um, should be here within the next half hour or so. And with all, well, all your people that are in the trader yes i mean in the um in yeah edgewater tavern i'm not going to take you through all the buildings they we this video's already gone on long enough um but we are going to take a look at a few key features yes please. one of them is Hello, down Peter. here down here and in this little cubby hole you will see a trap door it says open tunnels I thought this was really cool that he put this in here. Mm -hmm. They are. You have a tunnel. Let's and it's see. I am at one end. In, in, in the in town. Not all of them, no. No, just to just the important areas, I believe. Um, to the. Um, it's the inn, the guard house, I believe. Is it to your house? I don't think. You it's have to one the house. to your house. You do. I don't remember where it is then. This one goes to Blackthorn That's Manor. Blackthorn Manor. We'll go, come back to that one. Yeah, I didn't know, realize it was there. I'd have to look at it again. Because like I said, I have trouble getting into Blackthorn Manor. So. And down here to the, the Followers, followers barracks. barracks. So it takes you the inn, 
Followers Barracks and Your House. I want to see where it goes in the, into the Blackthorn Manor, please. Well, I, don't I, I wanted to come back in there again anyways. Thank you. If you can get in there. We had didn't, nothing crashed while we were out, gone. So far. Um, they said, he says it. they did, uh, started Fredis at 2.13 or something or other. And it's, um, Midas or more, more, Mundus. whatever, Mundus. Uh, but we don't know if it's what the month is, basically. Yeah, so. I forgot to check what the month is. We come up in the... Oh, in the armor. The armor. Oh, there it is at the at the base of. At yes. The, okay, and the stairs are just over there to your right, to your left. Yes. Okay. Like I said, it's, I. So that's pretty cool, but yeah, once everything is done, you do come in here, and they have chests here that are linked to all the stores. Yes. Just go collect your profits. You can also go to each of the store the. The trader and all the buildings and collect they have a chest there in each building that you can do it there which is how i have to because i can't always get into the I am um blackthorn manor so and it again it is a couple days at a time but you can let it go for whatever time you want it is fair to note that the um the citizen house rent and nico house rent uh, they do not have chests in their house. You do have to... They don't? No. I did not know that. I thought they did. And also the dock. We wanted to show the dock. Yes. There is... Um, we did mention there is a guest house behind Blackthorn Manor. Mm -hmm. And it does have two followers. Yeah. I don't... They don't really follow you. They can follow you if you tell them well, to. Well, yeah, but they don't start out that way. They're just two people. Now, a lot of times I don't do the followers. I don't hire the followers to live there. And I'll put one of my own followers in. Oops. Okay, it's good. Okay, it's good. Yeah, see how you can see how glitchy it's getting. It's starting to get a little glitchy here. Behind the stables here is the, the boathouse. Yes, there's a dock. There's a dock that runs all the way down. It's, oh, there it is. Yeah, this is just a dock right here. This is a park. Yes. This is not the travel system. That's not the, the travel system. It's all the way down here. You go down here, right exactly behind the house is the boathouse. Behind the manor is the boathouse. Yes. Peek Come through in the window. Here. No, peek through the window. No, no. Peek through the window. The dog was pushing me. Bear with me. <laughs> Activate travels. And Riften, Riverwood, Solitude, Windhelm, Winterhold, Dawnstar. All the holds in... Skyrim, it does not take you to Solstheim. Sorry. No, but it does, it takes you more to the, to more than the Scarlet will. Because Scarlet can take you to Riften. Yes. You know, so it, 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 and it does take you right there. It just takes you there. I mean, it, it's, this is a gorgeous mod to have. little planters down oh, here as well. It is a gorgeous mod to have. Indigo it, loves Riften. He loves Blackthorn. But it's, Glitchy. like I said, you do have to be wary of the crash to desktop, especially when entering Blackthorn Manor itself. Yes. And that, I swear, that does make me so sad. It's, I love this place. I, it took me, we've had it for a while, and it took me a long time not to keep trying, to keep trying, to keep trying. But... I love this. I mean, it's right in the. I love the Riften area. The the the, the sights of it. It's sunny and, well, it's not always sunny. <laughs> no. Um, but it's cool. And you got a farm. You do have a farm right there, behind those trees. It's outside the fence. The entrance is outside the fence. Um. And you have a mine. Yes. Now it's important whenever you do, um, furnishing these houses, that you check the town thoroughly because those two are very well hidden. Easy to miss, easy to forget. That and the guest house. And when you're going in there, um, most houses have a fireplace. With a little button on it. And you, you have to go and turn activate. it on. Except the mine. The mine says it has one. If it does, it's well hidden. All we can find is a um, like a cook pot and it's already going. So you don't have to go down in there. Cause, and the mine is sort of linear, but it goes down into the, you know, it's a, it's a mine. And you can go down in there, but I get lost, so I don't do a lot. 
Yeah, um, I think when. And you have uh, the get groundskeepers, the trader, the um, potions. You have a mill here as well. If you turn left, yeah, see the mill there? You can actually make uh, sacks of flour from wheat. It is a nice mod. It is definitely a income maker. It, it really is. It does take some time and some expense, but it's. I think it's well worth it. And if you can get it made and use it, I, I'm so happy for you. I can't stand it, but it breaks my heart that I cannot do that. I can go in the inn and all these places and get the money, but I, I have. It's rare that I can go into Blackthorn Manor. So guys, this is Blackthorn Manor from LD50365. Check out his mods on Bethesda. He's got a few others that are build a town yeah. type. Really fun to have. Great income makers. Um, I'm Gajara. I'm Ms. Milo 7. Be sure to hit the like and subscribe buttons down below so that you can keep up with our future reviews. This is Skyrim Mod Coffee Reviews, and we will see you with our next review.